Hi, my name is John Busick. I'm the ADAS Marketing Manager with Renesis in the United States. And we're very proud to be here today to show you this vehicle that we've developed. This is an autonomous driving development platform. We've designed this to position us to be able to work with OEMs and Tier 1s in order to develop autonomous vehicles that will be coming in the future. So, in order to develop an autonomous driving development platform, we felt you have to start with the building blocks, the sensors. So we've equipped this car with many powerful sensors for autonomous driving, including LiDAR sensor that we built into the side mirror, as well as six other LiDAR sensors that are around the perimeter of the car. Along with the LiDAR, we have a forward-facing camera, we have radar, V2X, and IMU, all the sensors you could need to give you a robust autonomous driving development platform. So what we've done is we've routed all that data into very powerful Renesis SOCs that are in the back seat. All right? And with those SOCs, we can perform applications for autonomous driving such as sensor fusion. We also are running surround view in the car. We also have a demonstration of V2X. All right? And our plan is to get to this point today with those building blocks. And over the next couple of years, we plan to take this car to full autonomy. We're very excited to be able to work with OEMs and Tier 1s to develop this groundbreaking technology that will be able to make cars safer for everyone. So now let's take a look at some of the high-performance silicon that Renesis has put in this car to make all these ADAS and autonomous driving features come to life. So we've actually equipped the car right now with four Renesis SOCs. From our SOC family, we call our car. Okay? So these three boxes you see on the bottom here, these are three R-Car H2s, our most powerful SOC in our current generation lineup. Up on the top here, we have an R-Car E2, right? Not as powerful, but lower cost, very effective. We're using this for a V2X solution. These two boxes right here are providing sensor fusion to the vehicle. So all the different powerful sensors that are in the car are being routed to these two boxes so we can fuse the data and provide one rock solid image of the road to autonomous driving algorithms, which are the next things we're going to develop for this car. The reason we have two boxes is because the number one focus at Renesis is always functional safety. All right? We want to have fail operation involved in all the autonomous driving algorithms development that we do. So we've already architected the car such that if a particular sensor were to fail, or even if one of these two boards were to fail, the autonomous driving algorithms would still have the capability of pulling the car over to the side of the road safely. For the third box that we have here, also using an R-Car H2, we're running surround view and forward camera image recognition. And that device, we're taking advantage of a special IP core we have designed for computer vision, which gives you great performance at low power with functional safety built in.